right. Hopefully the final um, battle. Well, it's named Last Battle. Said your prayer, superhero. This will be your grave. Oops. <laughs> you think you have me cornered? If you haven't noticed the change here, then you are a fool after all. You got some sort of glowy stuff. Mao, hold on a sec. It's strange. This feeling is. Oh, ho, ho. it seems the false hero is smarter. Or is it just that he's a coward? Watch closely. This is my true form. So Oops. Superhero transformation. Oh. What's happening? He's a monster, I say! Is that the superhero's true form? He's lived 200 years. Something tells me he's made a deal with something. Oh, how hideous. What a monstrous form. To have let such a thing be in control of the Academy. How horrifying. Hmm. When it comes to inedible ingredients like this, the only thing to do is get rid of it. <laughs> what part of this is a hero? It's almost like an evil god. Ah, I'm glad you noticed. That's right. These are parts of the enemies I sealed within my body over my adventures. Wow. After purifying their evil powers, I wore their blood and flesh to gain more for myself. That's kind of sick, dude. This body itself tells the stories of my history of battle. So how is it? Don't you think it's dignified and beautiful? It's pretty monstrous, man. Honestly, I'm about to puke. It's hideous. After that talk about being conscious of what the public thought, that image is brutal. No taste for beauty or common sense. I don't think anyone wants to be saved by a thing like you. Um... To be honest, it's lame. Damn you! Being a hero isn't about looks! What's important is power! Strength! No! What's important is the heart! The love it takes to save someone! The courage to stand against an enemy! That's right! The superhero Aurum that we knew is gone from this world! We'll leave the legends as legends! Yeah! Whatever stands in front of us isn't the superhero. It's an evil that endangers both our worlds. We'll go with that. Let's do this, everyone! This is the final battle! There's nothing to fear! Believe in me! <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? Yeah! I just realized I didn't buy anything. Oh boy. What? Where'd these assholes come from? Oh, what the F is this? Boone, Kane. Where the hell did these assholes come from? Oh my god, we're in trouble, guys.
looks kind of anti. Mm. Let's just see how that goes. Take this.
wonder if attacking him from the front's like total defense. Go, go! That's everyone. Go to me! Thank <laughs> you. 
So let me see if that works for right here. Oh, it really doesn't. Oh, that'll work. of evil gods and overlords. There was no losing factor. You don't even know the reason why you lost? Then that makes you a hopeless fool. Because he was alone. Well, he had those four 
really weak people. Superhero, you've been abandoned by the last one who admired and believed in you. Since then, you completely lost your right to be a hero and turned to evil. Because you were so desperate to stay a hero, you ignored being the hero. <laughs> what an ironic punishment. Sir Orm, why did this happen? I was tired. This way of life, the task of bringing down strong evils. I wasn't allowed to die. Stronger, 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 demanding to be the strongest. Even if I died, I was forced to come back to life. Oh, how could you die? Did I not even have the right to die? Jeez. I just wanted to live as a hero and die as a hero. How was he brought back? That's why I searched for the overlord everyone acknowledged as the strongest and sought for a place to die. Sir Orem. But after I defeated the strongest overlord, an immense sense of emptiness came over me. I no longer had any enemies. I realized there was no way to prove myself a hero. And then I became extremely afraid that I'd be forgotten by everyone. And that's when you saw the pure evil inside me. Yes. After seeing your hidden powers, I realized I still had a reason to exist. How very happy I was. <laughs> Though that ended a dream. <sighs> Why do villains have to rant about their own feelings at the end? <laughs> it's kind of true. Come on. Tolerate me at least for the end. It's a privilege for the defeated. <laughs> and he really wanted to be defeated. <laughs> Done with your prayers? I have no family, no friends left in this world. I have no one to protect. There is nothing I regret. Ah, uh, no. There's just one thing. Mao. Almaz, I'm sorry the superhero you guys admired had to end like this. Please, forgive me. No, oh, he apologized for being a douche. <laughs> what? I didn't admire you! You're not that good at hiding it. Goodbye, true heroes. I'm proud to have fought you in the end. And now, I will fall to hell. No, in this world it just turned into a prinny. Mao, finish me off, my little friend. Friend, huh? All right then, it's your final wish. I'll hear you out. Come, prepare. Now, finally. Just kidding. Why would I let you die that easily? I know, you cursed his dad to live perpetually. What? You thought I would allow a normal ending like that? I will keep you alive. I've decided to keep you as my guinea pig for my evil research. <laughs> Especially with that final form. You're a rare subject. It'll be worth my time to fix you up. Uh-oh. Let's see. Rockets in your knees, missiles for fingers, and shoot laser beams from your eyes. What? You're okay with an ending like that? Where's your happily ever after? That is his happily ever after. <laughs> Have you forgotten? I'm a demon! Your common sense doesn't work on me! To my lab! <laughs> No! <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Nervous laugh. I guess they reached an agreement, though it seems Sir Mao is still a little crazy. At least you avenged your dad, Mao. Eh, uh, sort of. Yeah, now I just need to beat dad and let him rest in peace. Let's head there.
I'm coming, Dad! He's sparkly. Dad? Cool. Huh? That seems a little strange. He's already passing on, it seems. Does this mean... Indeed. Mao did a splendid job cooking up the superhero. He's gained friends and fully understands his heart. I'm sure the Overlord will rest in peace now. The spell that bound his soul here has disappeared. Boom! <laughs> Boom. I see. So he didn't have a grudge with Mao. He just wanted to make sure he was okay. I bet he was just worried about you, and that's why he couldn't pass on. Impossible! Dad had to have hated me! I doubt it. I'm sure he's been watching over you even after he died. The whole time. <laughs> Whatever. Just because Dad can't talk doesn't mean you can interpret for him. I hope he talks. You've become strong. You've grown up now. No. Dad, is that really you? I'm relieved. I can go now. That's a kind voice. See? <laughs> Dad! Maybe we should get out of here. <laughs> the rest is for family only. I saw nothing, heard nothing. Dad. I know. You now know. You gained many precious things from many of your friends. You will be fine. You can do it. I leave the Netherworld and Evil Academy to you. The next Overlord is you, Mao. Dad! Aww. Dad? I will become the Overlord! I'll become even greater than you! I'll be the greatest overlord ever! <laughs>